Hello everyone. Today we shall look into few other functions where we could convert the table to columns, list, records and rows. Here we have a sample table where I have few IDs, name and location. Okay. I'll uh, quickly add a new step. I'll show you how to convert this uh, table to columns. I'll write table dot columns. I'll open the parenthesis. Okay. I'll write table dot two columns and open the parenthesis after the function. Here I have the previous step which is hash change a type. You could see in my applied steps. Okay, this is my uh, table in the previous step. I'll enclose it in parenthesis and click here. You could see that once I click on the first list, here I have got my columns where it is my ID column. This is my name column and this is my location column. This is how we convert table to different list or different columns we could say. Similarly, let us see how to convert this table into list format. I'll quickly add a step. Okay. I'll type table dot to list. I'll open the parenthesis and I'll provide the table which is in my source. I'll click here as, I, as soon as I click here you could see that by default my data in the table is uh, you know separated with a comma and uh, the data of every row is arranged into a list. This is how we convert table to a list using table dot to list function. Let us see how to convert a table to records. I'll add a step. Similarly I'll type table dot to records and open the parenthesis. You could provide the table name as it is in my source. I'll type source and click here. Here you could see that we have list of records. As I click on the first record, here you could see that my first row along with their column names, it is provided in the record format as, I, as you could uh, see. Similarly, each and every row is made into a record. I have 20 rows, so I have 20 records. Using this function, you could convert the table to records uh, here in Power Query. I'll uh, quickly move on to the other function. I'll uh, show this table in the row format. I'll quickly add a new step. Okay, I'll type table dot two rows. I'll open the parenthesis and provide the source step or which you could say the table name. Okay, I'll click here. Here you could see that I have list of lists. Okay, as I click on the first list here, here you could see that my values of uh, three columns like ID, name and location is formed up, is formed into a list rather than the record. Okay, this is how uh, this list of lists are formed in rows. Okay, this is how table gets converted into rows and you could utilize it in multiple functions. If you are able to understand how to convert to list, column, records and rows, that would be helpful to make other operations if required in complex queries. This is all for now. Thank you for watching and we shall meet in the next video.